Hello guys, my name is Xrelic and you guys are watching a 13-in-1 on the map slums using the PDW, my favorite gun in this game with the gold camo and the trifecta of attachments, or at least I thought so back in the day when I used three attachments, the grip, the adjustable stock, and the long barrel. The long barrel obviously super powerful on any machine guns. My cat is currently looking at me, this is super weird. It's like, what is this, what is this microphone on your desk? What is it doing? Who are you talking to? Yes, I am talking to a microphone. <laughs> uh, okay, fine. Turn your back on me. Whatever. Uh, I had a funny story for you guys actually today. I was, obviously my parents are moving, and I was taking apart a shelf unit. And as I, I was unscrewing a screw from its hinge, something actually fell out and hit me in the face because I was lying underneath it because the screw was on the bottom of a shelf. I was like, oh, what the fuck? Is this like a, a bug, a spider? Oh, my God. And I absolutely hate spiders. But it turned out to be none of that. It was actually, how do I describe this? Your Xbox controller has a little indent in the middle of its of its thumbstick. It turned out to be a coin that actually fit inside the middle of the thumbstick in a little indent. It was a 1938 Buffalo Head nickel. And I I, I picked it up. I was like, oh, what is this? Like a children's children's little toy thing from back in the day? Because this this shelf unit was probably 20 years old, almost as old as I am. I've had it for as long as I can remember. And it turns out that this nickel from 1938 with the buffalo head on it and the Indian, it had an Indian head on the other side as well. It ended up being worth about five bucks in the condition I found it in. And if it was uncirculated and in perfect condition, it would have been worth about 20 bucks, which is just nuts for finding a nickel, a nickel, which is at some point worth five cents. I don't know. It's just, it's crazy that that was hiding in a screw hinge in one of our 20 year old shelf units. And uh, it fell on my face as, as we were moving. And I just thought that was pretty nuts. And I, I just want to share it with you guys because there's, I mean, shit, stuff like that does not happen often. Stuff like that just is a rare occurrence where you have like a cool little story like that that probably has never happened much before in the history of mankind. I mean, how often do you think someone has been taking apart a shelf unit and had a 1938 nickel fall onto their face? I just, I don't, I don't think that is, that is a common occurrence. <laughs> but outside of that story, it is the last day of 2012. It is currently December 31st, and December as a whole has been amazing. At the start of December, I had, ooh, 67 subscribers or something like that. And, if, like, December 2nd, I marked on, like, one of my videos and dysfunction, like, one of my videos. And I think that's where a lot of you found my channel from, which has been amazing because I'm currently sitting at 428, I think it is, which is a huge growth. I've grown five times over or something like that, six, seven times over. It's been incredible. And I just wanted to thank every single one of you for subscribing, checking out my content, leaving comments, leaving likes, leaving suggestions, and leaving... Uh, general improvements that I can do it just it's been amazing I really appreciate it because this has been a lot of fun for me and I don't know I it just it's it all comes down to you guys I make videos because I hope you guys enjoy them and the more of you that leave your comments and feedback and, and let me know what you think the more I enjoy making the videos so I hope that you guys do stick around and do actually enjoy my content and just, uh, just you know hanging around and and there's a group of you that make fun of me behind my back. I don't know. <laughs> but no, I hope you guys do enjoy my content. And I really appreciate you all coming over to my channel and subscribing and watching all my videos. And I hope you guys did enjoy this video because the next time that I do see you, it will be 2013. So I will see you guys then. Peace.